Happy Sunday. I keep circling back the last few days just to, you know, love or fear, you know, the decisions that I make throughout the day that I've made throughout my life and how often I've grasped fear for the motivation of my decision, even when I didn't think I was. And I think whenever you're grasping selfishness or you're coming into any decision from a degree of selfishness, it's a place of fear for me. <laughs> I just can only speak for me because if, if it's, I'm afraid I'm not gonna get what I need, not gonna get what I think I deserve uh, or think I need or expect to want to have, all that stuff. It's a place of fear versus you know, coming at it with a plate from a place of we <laughs> versus me. You know, how is this going to serve the greater relationship with whatever I'm engaging in? Person, work, friendship, intimacy, whatever, all of that stuff. What's my motive? Am I there to be of service? Or am I there to take? And it's, I mean, for me, I know when I go back and dissect my motives, sometimes it's, it, it's, it's very subconscious, you know? I may think I'm doing it for the greater good, but there's a little bit of selfishness in there. And nobody's perfect. I am far from perfect. So, you know, I think it's, Attempting to get closer to, you know, that unconditional place of love versus that <laughs> huge place of fear and just trying to get closer to that uh, bullseye. And if, <laughs> if you haven't even been thinking about, you know, getting into a place of love or uh, leading with love and service, then if you start to think about that, then you're probably gonna be closer than you were if you were just being a selfish prick. And it's about individual spiritual, or individual growth, I guess, spiritual growth, growth, whatever. So I sometimes fall into the trap of comparing myself to somebody else, and that that's not useful. We all have our own journey. We all start at different places. We've, in my opinion, we've ordered it the way we've ordered it for ourselves to grow and learn. So, I constantly have to remember that, I mean, comparing myself to anybody is unfair to them and to me. Uh, and usually I'm the one who loses in that comparison. Um, but also, the where have I come from? Where was I before I started to think about growing and changing? How was I a couple months before that? Because the closer I got to that point of change, I was starting to maybe think about some change, maybe. But when I think about, when I look at that, you know, the lead up to that months before, when I was completely out of control, and then I can also, like, I've been doing my best to grow for a number of years now, and I am grateful for some of the hindsight to be able to be like, oh yeah, 10 years ago, <laughs> I was better than I was 20 years ago, but I was, I, I still have, and still have, I still have a lot of change, I still have a lot of growth, but 10 years ago, whew, hot mess chaotic mess, angry. And 20 years ago, I was like the Tasmanian devil. So, yeah, happy Sunday. Noisy, I don't know if you can hear that. Big light, much love, peace.